Hi guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can verify your Arch Linux GUI ISOs after you have downloaded them uh, from SourceForge or OSDN. So in this video I'll discuss how we can do this on Windows as well as Linux and uh, I'm doing this on Windows 11 but this is applicable uh, on all uh, versions of Windows from 7, 8, uh, 10 and obviously 11. And same thing with Linux distributions, it will be applicable to all Linux distributions. So first on Windows, how do we verify the downloads? Uh, by the way, why would we want to verify our downloads? That is because you would want to verify that you have downloaded exactly what I uploaded. All right, that makes sense. Uh, and usually what happens is if you are downloading via a torrent or sometimes you know the download fails for some reason and then you continue it, there is a chance that your file might get corrupted. So in order to verify that the file is 100% what I uploaded, uh, we can go ahead and verify the checksums. So I've uploaded here on SourceForge SHA-256sum.txt, which you can download. I've already done that and opened it here in Notepad on Windows. Uh, what this file essentially is, it basically contains all of the checksums uh, that of the ISOs that I've uploaded here on SourceForge. So that so the nine ISOs that are here, which are main editions, four of them which are the themed editions and five of them which are pure editions, uh, which stock desktop. So all of them uh, are listed accordingly. There's also the checksum for the Zen ISO and the uh, Mate ISO, which is uh, in uh, the beta ISO folder, all right? This should be over here, right? So once you download this file, uh, what you can do essentially is, uh, you want to right click here on Windows 11, uh, you can right click here and open in Windows Terminal. Uh, actually this thing is Windows PowerShell as you can see over here. So if you are on Windows 10, Windows 8 or Windows 7, you would want to open PowerShell in the directory, um, in the directory where the file has been downloaded. So that's usually your downloads folder. Uh, the path is going to be c colon user your username and then downloads all right so that's going to be the path so now what you want to do is i've listed the instruction how you can verify uh your iso which you have downloaded so in windows this is the command which you can copy and paste now obviously this is going to give us an error so because iso name has to be replaced all right so we're going to replace ISO name with what? We are going to replace ISO name with the name of the ISO we want to verify. So let's say we want to verify the XFCE ISO, this one. All right, so I'm just going to right click and copy the name. All right, and I'm going to paste it in front of, uh, what I did is Control Shift V, all right? Uh, sometimes you might get a prompt that do you want to paste this text over here? So control shift we paste uh, pastes it. It's pretty much like the Linux terminal. Uh, on PowerShell, uh, the, the traditional PowerShell, which is on Windows 10, 7 or 8, if control shift V doesn't work, then you might have to manually type it, all right? So you can go ahead and hit enter. And this, uh, after a few seconds, will give you a string. That string will look something like this, and it has to match with this, uh, with this string. So right now we are taking a look at the XFCE edition. So the terminal should give us this string. Let's go ahead and see if that's the case. So let me put it like this. All right. So yeah, as we can see, this string exactly matches with this string and hence uh, the download is legit. And this is exactly what I've uploaded. All right. This is how you verify your uh, Arch Linux GUI ISOs in Windows. Now let's hop over to Linux and see uh, how we do it over there. All right, so now let's quickly take a look at how we can verify your Arch Linux GUI ISOs in Linux. So this is pretty simple. I'm already on Arch Linux. Uh, this is the ALG XFCE edition. And what I'm going to be doing here can be done on all Linux distribution, whether it's Debian based, Arch based, uh, Fedora based, or any, you get the point, Gen2 based, all right? So the method is going to be the same. You want to get this string over here. 
so you want to open a terminal in the folder where you have downloaded the ISO I have it here in the downloads folder this is the cinnamon edition and uh, what you want to do is open a terminal here by right clicking and then I can type in SHA-256 sum arch uh, tab to autocomplete uh, basically the name of your uh, ISO which you downloaded hit enter and this should give us the same string so here uh, this is the cinnamon edition so sh uh, so we should get this string all right let's have a look right so this is that string exactly as it is and hence you can verify that uh, your download is legit all right so this is how you do it in linux on mac os you can go ahead and uh, type in sha sum dash a 256 uh, iso name dot iso wherein iso name is going to be the iso you downloaded so this is how you verify your downloads in windows linux and mac obviously i don't have a macbook to show you how to do it in mac but this is how we do it in windows and linux uh, you can subscribe to this channel this is where i post uh, updates on the arch linux gui project uh, you can also join our discord server if you have any doubts and thank you so much for watching and i hope you have a nice day